Christy doing exactly what Coach Emin Lontok asked for. And after a very tight finish, a tug of war to attain the first set, UST finally taking it 27 to 25. That's right, Anton. And uh, you know, it was, you know, you can see from both teams that they want this game. And much more for, uh, of course, USC really needs this one uh, to stay on and uh, for the crown. But uh, FEU also so pumped up, started really aggressive, but USC's defense was just there once again. The, the thing that was missing from them in the first game, ito na, blocking na naman na USC, present. Let's take a look at some of these statistics here, Mosey. And uh, USC, finally, 20 attack points. I say that because, uh, and 10 for FEU in the first set. I say that because USC averaged less than 10, point, 10 attack points in game number one. Mga siguro 9 attack points per set ang USC that game one. Today, in the first set, 20 attack points for them. Then for FEU and uh, of course in the blocking department, FEU having four, USC with two and the errors USC having nine and FEU having four. Alam mo yung errors na nga sa men's game ano eh? Parang hindi siya masyado it doesn't tell the story kasi even in the first game, ang daming errors yeah. ng FEU, 30 errors and yet, they were able to win that game. In the first set, nine errors for USD, apat lang for FAU, and yet USD was able to win the game. So it, it's just, uh, it just gets to show that sa men's game, talagang ang uh, buong total, all departments ang uh, kailangan, di ba? It's a balanced game. Yeah, we would like to thank everybody tuning in right now to Studio 23 for our exclusive ABS-CBN sports coverage of game number two of the men's volleyball finals of UAAP season 74, FEU won game number one, a straight set victory. USD trying to come back here after taking the first set 27 to 25. Right now, that service error puts FEU on top by one here in set number two, three to two. Marvin Avila silenced at the end of that opening set after getting blocked. Fight that and on the support. Labrador just trying to send it over to the other side. They go back to the Pante. Oh. Wait, I'm here in front. De La Calzada and Labrador when they are in the That's front the line. Very tall, very long, very athletic. They jump high. Uh, you can't uh, just try and Challenge. dip it. <laughs> Chance ball for FEU. De Ocampo oh. to Labrador. That's just a smart move by JR. And uh, Labrador, easy time for him to get that point because the blockers are already committed. Look, late night. I nakuna yung blockers, and so I Labrador easily get taking that point. Jason Ramos. And a net violation on the FEU. 5 to 3 is our tally here in set number 2. FEU up by 2. Jason Ramos has come alive in the first set, really made an impact. Especially with that last block on Arvin Avila. Ala Calzada too much. That goes long, not enough spin. This is the fourth meeting here in UAP Season 74 for FEU and USD. Of course, uh, in the elimination round, USD drew first blood. Take a look at it one more time, Kurt Federan. Nothing Jolo Doloiras could do there, Federan. He has to come up with a big game in his, what could be his finale here in the UAAP. Oh, that goes into the net. Error on the line. I 
wonder if one of the USD players will do the finger wag on De La Calzada <laughs> later on in this game. <laughs> Sets it up to JR. And that catches the <laughs> well, FEU getting the point there. Pietro Del Campo running set there. Oh, that was well read by Faitaren. Sets it up to Depante. Dug up there. Labrador denied. Popped up. De Ocampo. Faitaren received there by Jason Ramos. Oh! Depante now for UST. Labrador, he likes that spot. He really likes it away from the net. <laughs> FU off to a raging start. They are up 8-6. to six. This is game two of the UAAP Men's Volleyball Finals. was able to take the first set 27 to 25 FEU trying to bounce back and that most recent point by the Tamaraos courtesy of JR Labrador he really has a powerful kill that's amazing eh, if you take it up eh. the volume yeah. hits the Labrador it makes the receiver look really good <laughs> USD ha had a couple of uh, nice. Uh, uh, well, Paul, they were able to receive yeah, Paul, Labrador's. Uh, Paul Chad is doing hits. a great job for USD. That's uh, Paul Chad and Moiras. Bert Pelliran with the service error. Per Uka. One of three players who could be playing in this final game. Avila, I can really uh, see it in his eyes that he wants to finally win a championship. Yes. I mean, he's been it's, here for four seasons. And this is the biggest chance. Oh, yeah. Well, Petros de Ocampo, that was his 45th service error here in UAP season 74. Oh, an emphatic point there. Alcantara looking at Coach Emil Lundov not able to close out this block. Look at him opening. It's who he said he wasn't able to close it out. Dapat kasi yun yung left hand niya nakapasok so that the ball will go in the court of FEU. Oh, nice setting job. But Dug up there. Na FEU because it hit the net. Credit and you were just saying the good feeling of being able to dig up Labrador's spikes. Oh, ho, ho, nobody able to dig up Arvin Avila's kill right there. That's right, perfect timing for Avila. He went way up in the air for that kill. Look at him go uh, over. Kanta kasi no combination play eh, coming from FEU. Able to just avoid that double block of USD. Well, Labrador decoy the zigzag move on Labrador. Well, we saw Coach George Pasqua use Labrador as a decoy in that do or die game against La Salle. And, and a check ball. Oh. That's a long one, but a check ball. 
USD unhappy with that call. And referee Efre Gaa just too sure that it was a check ball. It happened actually right in front of him. This is the biggest game, I have the biggest lead, excuse me, by uh, any team here in game number two. Free ball here for FEU. Labrador yes. was not sure what he wanted to do there. That's right. His timing, that last play to Rui. Let's see that once again. Sayang, ang ganda ng abot niya. From defense. <laughs> and spoiled on his offensive move. He'll try again. Simple 